Hey, what's up? I'm Daniel from today's iPhone.com. Ever since updating to iOS 4.3, I have had crappy battery life. Not everyone has, but I have. So I'm going to show you some tips to um, conserving your battery life. So let's do this. So first of all, you're going to go to settings, and you're, here's some things you can turn off. You can turn off your 3G. That's number one. Um, that uses, some people say like twice as much battery as Edge. So Go to general, then go to network, turn off 3G, that'll save you a lot of battery life. And you can still connect to Edge and it'll be fine. I don't know why mine, there we go. Now it says Edge. Um, even, we're, even using uh, Wi-Fi is better than using 3G. So you, if you want to get fast internet and you are in a Wi-Fi range, you can turn off a 3G and just use Wi-Fi. Also, if you're not going to use any internet, you can turn off the Wi-Fi completely because it's still going to be searching and stuff like that, and that'll use battery. Um, notifications, you can turn those off, or you can turn, um, you know, the ones you're not going to be using. If you have to use, let's say, Facebook notifications, you can leave that on, but you can turn off, you know, Game Center. Just turn off all those if you want to. Or you can just turn them all off by uh, tapping right there, turn that off. That will save you some battery life. Turn your location settings off. That's a big one too because, you know, GPS and all that kind of stuff. So you can just flip that off and it's not going to be using any. Now you're going to want to make sure you turn it back on again once you've charged it because, especially with the whole Find My iPhone thing, it's kind of necessary. Um, you can, you're going to want to uh, mute your iPhone too because obviously sounds take up uh, battery life. So you mute that. And don't be playing games that are vibration. You can turn that vibrate off if you go into sounds and you just hit uh, silent. You can turn that vibration off, vibration off right there too. And so those games that do have vibrate, they should go off because that uses battery life. Um, you can dim the brightness of the screen, turn that all the way down, and it's still usable. And, uh, you know, it'll save some battery life. And then if you're really desperate, you can put it on airplane mode. Now, obviously, you won't be getting any calls or anything, but you can still play games and use it as an iPod. One quick tip that isn't going to save you very much battery life, but it could save you some, is by killing all the apps in your uh, dock here that are running. The most important ones you're going to want to kill are, uh, like, Pandora or Skype, you know, those ones that have, like, uh, sound and stuff. Those are going to be important ones to kill. So there's Pandora, there's Skype... Just kill all of these, and you are going to save some battery life. One more thing you'd want to do is you would want to go to mail, and you're, you'd want to uh, turn fetch new data. You'd want to turn off push, and you'd want to set this to manually. So uh, what that says is it's not going to fetch your email for you, you're going to have to check it yourself, and that'll save you some battery life. So I'm Daniel from today's iPhone.com. Uh, I hope this helped you out because, you know, now I'm going to have to re-find uh, all those apps that were open and reopen them because, you know, that's how I rolled. So you can follow me at Twitter at Twitter.com slash TIP underscore Daniel. All right. Live well and prosper. Live long and prosper? Is that it? Whatever's box it.